ever thought you were in love with someone but then realized you were just staring in the mirror for 20 minutes? Hey guys, it's Christina. So for this week, you guys voted for me to talk about Kanye West, the fashion designer. Mm -hmm. If you followed New York Fashion Week, right now is Paris Fashion Week actually. So we're seeing all these new designs by all of these really luxurious brands but a few weeks ago was New York Fashion Week and Kanye West debuted his collection for Adidas. The collection was actually named Kanye West by Adidas original Yeezy Season 1 which is kind of a mouthful but whatever you know he's God apparently so I'll let it pass. Obviously Kim Kardashian was there, Diddy was there, Rihanna, um, Anna Wintour, oh my god, she was there. So was Alexander Wang, Beyonce, Jay-Z, all these um, super A-list people were there to check out what Kanye had to show. This morning I was looking at articles and I found one um, by the LA Times. They reviewed um, his collection and they talked about what happened throughout the show, kind of like the reception of it, what people think of it. And one of the quotes that kind of struck me was that Kanye actually said, you know, I'm not a designer, which is kind of shocking because he thinks so highly of himself and I'm not saying that's a bad thing. But, you know, you would think he'd be like, well, yeah, I'm a fashion designer. But he admits that he's learning. Personally, after seeing the collection, I think that he has a lot to learn. I personally have never put on a fashion show, which is on my to-do list. But the collection was a little... It didn't feel luxe to me. It was a bit strange. I know the show started out with him kind of just talking, rambling, kind of, and then um, the lights kind of turned on and you could see um, all the models with all the different pieces and I've had various conversations with a lot of different people. Like, it was a huge deal in my world, like, what just happened? You know, his collection is um, full of nice pieces to go to the gym if you want to look like you just went through a car wash and then got run over by a few buses, a train, and a semi. Um, that's pretty much what it looked like to me. I don't know. I don't know. I was expecting a lot. I mean, I wasn't expecting like a Chanel show because obviously Adidas is not, they don't have that type of aesthetic, but I was expecting something a lot more glamorous, a lot more... I don't know why I was expecting gold and metallics. I, I don't know. Like, if Kanye considers himself royalty, I kind of expected, like, this grand um, collection. You know, it was, it was a little confusing. I give him credit for trying. It did get a lot of people's attention, so that's always a huge plus. That's... That's the intent of having a collection, especially at New York Fashion Week. He is known to be friends with high-end fashion designers like Ricardo Tichy from um, Givenchy um, and, all, and obviously Alexander Wang who was actually at the show. So he has a lot of inspiration around him besides his music. I think that in the future we probably will see a lot of great things from him. I hope he doesn't decide to postpone his music career. Like I said, I don't really listen to him but I think um, that would kind of disappoint a lot of people and um, I think he just should stick to his day job. And he himself said in this article by the LA Times that, you know, it takes more than just overnight to become Prada or a huge brand like that. So I think with this collection that he collaborated with Adidas, um, I think it's just the start for him. I think eventually he will probably have his own um, brand, the House of Kanye or something. Um, and that would be a lot of fun to see. I mean, I... I'm personally open to new ideas, new things, whether I would wear them or not, whether I like it or not, um, doesn't matter how they're perceived. So I'm I'm pretty curious to see what 
he comes up with next. Kanye really, he does have a great sense of style, whether he's like at a basketball game wearing a fur coat or he's walking around New York City in neon scarves and who knows what. He, he knows fashion. You should probably stay tuned to see what he comes up with next, what he's wearing. Um, he's definitely a trendsetter and I think he's going to become more of a mainstream trendsetter um, in the following season. I would love to see Kanye collaborate with more high-end designers like maybe Raph Simmons, um, Sarah Burton, that might be kind of a cool collaboration, or even Stella McCartney since she kind of has like musical ties considering that her dad is Paul McCartney and he's collaborated with Kanye before so that might be those are just my suggestions. Thank you guys for watching. Please let me know what you think of this video. Give me suggestions and also keep voting. A lot of um, projects are still in the works but um, I'm working to bring more material, more stuff to the blog so keep checking in. Bye. When I'm on a flight and I wake up with a water bottle next to me like oh great now I gotta be responsible for this water bottle. You may be talented but you're no Kanye West.